the table, you need to do three things. First, decide what you're going to eat. Actually go and buy the ingredients you need, and then decide when you're actually going to make it. So I have two um, online resources for you to hopefully make this process a little easier for you, a little more simple, and maybe even a little more fun. The first one is called plantoeat.com. Now plantoeat.com, what I like about it is it actually has a um, place where you can keep all your recipes in one spot. Now these are recipes that you can um, clip from other internet sites, um, you can get them from blogs, and you can even enter in your own recipes that you like. And then what happens is when you decide what you, that you're going to plan your meals for the next week or month or however long, you actually just drag and drop your recipes into a calendar here. So it comes up with a whole schedule for you. But then what it does is it automatically generates a shopping list for you. And the shopping list is based, um, uh, broken down into categories. You can actually um, customize these categories so that they follow the order of the aisles in your favorite grocery store. You can um, add items that you know you also need that aren't necessarily um, part of the ingredients for the recipes that you're going to make that week, like toilet paper or you know milk or whatever. And then you can also delete items that were um, generated automatically, but you know you already have in your pantry. And then, to make things even better, there's a mobile site. So you can um, access this shopping list on your smartphone. You can have, even check things off as you go through the grocery store aisles. So you don't have to print anything off or have any paper or pen. So that is plantoeat.com. It costs $5 a month. There is a 30-day free trial, and if you decide to do a year's worth, it only costs $39 a month. Now, the other uh, website I wanted to tell you about is called Emails. Now, this is different. Emails is for people who um, aren't really interested or don't have the time to um, actually decide what you're going to eat each week. Emails is you subscribe, and each week they send you... Um, uh, a meal plan and you can choose a meal plan based on how many people you're going to be cooking for as well as what kind of meals you like to eat like low carb, gluten free, um, even um, organic. So um, they send you a week's worth of dinners recipes, they send you the shopping list and then you can just go to the store and you have everything already written out for you. E-meals also costs about five dollars a month but you'll easily recoup it because what emails also does is they plan meals based on the sales at your local grocery store. So you're going to save time and money. So I hope these resources are going to be helpful for you. I hope you have good meal planning. This has been your Tuesday tip. Thanks for watching.